guys. So we started our first video this afternoon, and now they stormed the Senate. I'm just saying it's crazy to see the state of America right now. People with no masks, they haven't been screened. They're going to get charged by the federal government. In other words, the feds is coming. Where's Trump? We know he's been in the Oval Office telling people to go commit felonies, but he's nowhere to be seen. Got people coming out in stretchers. You got police officers having to deal with all this stress. Look at that. They woke up today not realizing they had to deal with all this. This is going to be a long-term thing. Now they got to worry about COVID. They got to worry about the news and people showing them in the ugly, ugly side. But of course, they're saying it's a peaceful protest. Thank you for joining us. First of all, are you and your colleagues safe right now? Yeah, everybody's safe. I don't want to give my location, but I'll tell you this is the safest madness. Yeah, straight madness. Man, you better be ashamed as an American. What type of what type of sense do you have? American history, and this is what we got going on. All the troops that died for this country. All the people that go overseas, all the Vietnam vets, all the Korean vets, all the Iraqi vets, all the Afghanistan vets, all the police officers that go home every day stressed out, federal agents, border patrol, everybody fighting for this man, thinking he, oh yeah, he's he, he, he's for this country, having people commit felonies because he he's hurt, he didn't he didn't win. He couldn't man up and say, all right, I'll come back in 2024. No, he had to be a baby about it. Uh, throwing on escape hoods. I mean, we have these, you know, emergency escape hoods that we think it's one of those doomsday scenarios. What is this going to do for the rest of the country? What happens when this trickles down and people are in the gas station upset, they're in the grocery store upset? the president actually quits being a coward. What the heck? He calls in the D.C. guard and actually takes some leadership for a moment. He ain't doing no leadership. He eating bonbons in the White House right now, chilling. For my younger viewers, Google what a bonbon is. The siege of the Capitol. Who else is going to be responsible? Not Jesus. Jesus didn't send them people to do that. Love thy neighbor as thyself. What type of love is this? Yeah, it's not a surprise to us, but we are surprised. We are not shocked, but we are surprised. Don't care about nobody but himself.